I just finished cleaning my house and I want to show you guys what I use to clean my house because I get lots of questions about my Norwex cloths. Um, so I figured this week was a good week to tell you about them. Also, I got, I just got this shirt and I love it, but I didn't realize there was a sticker on it when I put it in the wash until it got dried and it left this sticky residue. Um, so if you have any ideas about how to get sticky residue off clothing, let me know. I use lemon essential oil on most sticky things, but I don't know if I can put it on my clothes because I'm worried it will leave like oil stains. Anywho, back to Norwex. So I use, exclusively use Norwex cloths to clean my whole house. Um, I just, you just use them with water. I don't use any sprays. I do keep um, vinegar spray and or thieves spray from Young Living in my kitchen to like spray my um, stove to get grease off it. And I make a toilet spray, like a toilet cleaner spray out of essential oils and hydrogen peroxide um, for my toilet. And that's it. So anyway, I don't, but like when I'm cleaning my house for the day, I don't use sprays. I just use these cloths. So why Norwex as opposed to other microfiber? Um, Norwex's claim to fame is that their microfibers are thousands and thousands and thousands of times smaller than the microfiber of you know, other cloths on the market. So like when I used to use cloths off Amazon or the Costco microfiber cloths, I would throw them away after a while because they would start to just spread stuff around. Like they wouldn't actually pick stuff up. Norwex microfiber truly, truly picks stuff up. Like stuff gets in here. And so when I'm cleaning, um, I can just keep folding it. Like I usually clean with it like this. And then I have all these clean surfaces, you know, if I keep folding it around and I don't have to rinse it a ton. So I pretty much clean my whole house with these two cloths. This is an Enviro cloth. This is like for everything, dusting, wiping, wiping stuff off the walls. Um, and this is a window cloth. This is like a magic cloth. Um, I use this for windows, yes, but also for stainless steel. It takes all the fingerprints off my stainless steel. Um, for mirrors, any like shiny surfaces, it shines, your, it'll shine your faucets. Literally just water, it will not use streaks. It's pretty amazing. Um, I actually keep a mini size one of these hanging in my kitchen, in the cabinet under my kitchen sink so I can like really quickly wipe fingerprints off my stainless. So I have never used sprays on my stainless. This is all I use. And my stainless is shiny. So if you have stainless, I would get yourself one of these. These two cloths come in a pack called the basic pack. And that's where I would start. If you're like, there are so many options. What do I want to buy? What should I get? Just start with the basic pack. It'll get you an Enviro cloth and a window cloth. And literally what I do on Thursdays or Fridays, whenever I'm cleaning my house, I go from room to room and I touch every surface is like my mantra. So I wipe the windows in every room. I wipe the mirrors. If there's a mirror, I dust all the like dressers and bookshelves and surfaces. I wipe the ceiling fans. I wipe, I don't know, the walls if they have fingerprints and stuff on them. Like there's some right there. Um, I just touch every surface. I wipe down toys. Literally with these two cloths. I usually like walk around the house with them over my shoulders. <laughs> um, and then I have a Norwex kitchen mop to mop my floors. And then in the bathrooms, I have um, a blue colored Enviro cloth, which I use to wipe my counters. I have a gray one for my floors. The colors don't matter. It's the same cloth. It just, I like the color coded stuff. Um, and then I have a, a window cloth in each bathroom for the mirrors and the faucets. And I use uh, like old burp rags or something to wipe my toilets because I think toilets are gross and I bleach those rags and you can't bleach Norwex. So I do clean my toilets with like rag rags. Um, so if you're wondering where to start, I would get the basic pack. It'll get you an Enviro cloth and a window cloth and you'll be able to clean most of the things in your house with these. Like when you, you know, walk around your house and you're wiping stuff up, you'll be able to do it with these. The other thing I would encourage everyone to buy is a kitchen cloth trio. These are the best hands down <laughs> kitchen cloths that I have ever used. Uh, I've been using them for, like I said, years, probably five years now. It's exclusively, I don't use any other like washcloth in my kitchen. Um, they have ribs and actually they have some now that have a more like a square pattern. I love those too. So either or, um, but they come in a trio and I recommend getting three, getting the trio because A, you'll save money, but B, I um, get a new one every night. So every night I wring out my old one, I hang it to dry. That's the biggest thing for me with Norwex claws is you have to hang them to dry before you put them in a pile to go in the wash because otherwise they do get musty if you just leave them in a wet pile. Um, and also the backlock technology, that like silver technology that gets the bacteria out of the rags, um, it has to have time to work while the cloths are drying. So you don't want them lumped in a pile. So anyway, I, ha I ha have like a command strip hooks. The end of the night, I hang it up on a hook, like the dirty one, 
to dry overnight and I get a clean one out and put a clean one over my sink and then my kitchen is clean. Um, I do that pretty much every night. So I like having multiple, I probably have like 15 of these because I have a lot of Norwex and I just do a load of laundry every two weeks with it. Um, so I have enough to get me by for two weeks. But if you're just starting, I would just get three, three, the kitchen cloth trio. Um, I, like I said, I've been collecting it for years and years and I also used to host like parties and so I would get tons of free cloths which was very helpful um okay so the kitchen the basic package and then the kitchen cloth trio is where i would start like pretty much full stop some other things i love they have kitchen towels which i won't get it for you but anyway it's like a big towel um i keep lots of them hanging in my kitchen and i use them to when i'm hand washing my dishes because i hand wash a lot of my dishes uh and I just leave one like by my sink and I put dishes on top of it because it soaks up so much water and I don't like having a big drying rack out. Um, and I find that regular kitchen towels don't soak, soak up enough water to actually dry my dishes. So I leave them all sitting out on a Norwex towel. The other thing I love are these hand towels. I have one in each bathroom. They're the best hand towels ever. I get really annoyed by towels. I also have one hanging on my stove in my kitchen. Um, I get very annoyed by towels that don't actually dry my hands all the way when I'm drying my hands. These dry your hands in like one swipe. They're so nice. So they're a little pricey, but I just have three of them and they'll last forever um, and I love them. And the other thing that I love is this, what is this thing called? Enviro scrub cloth. I think it comes in a three pack or a two pack. I keep these hanging in my shower. So it's, an, it's small, which I love. It's an Enviro cloth on one side and then a scrubby cloth on the other. This is what I use to clean my shower, my bathtub, whatever. I actually use a little bit of Castile soap on this side. It has fared just fine. Anyway, I use some Castile soap. I scrub, 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 rinse my shower down. Um, but what I love about this is that on this side is an Enviro cloth. And so every time I get out of the shower, I just real quick, like this is literally hanging over my faucet. I real quick just wipe the faucet and the bathtub thing um, to get all water spots off it so I don't have water spots on my you know shiny bathroom stuff and therefore I'm never having to like work hard to scrub water spots off so those are some things that I love I am more than happy to tell you other things that I love as well um, but I know that it can get really overwhelming and I don't want you to feel death by option so if you're like where do I start I would just start with the basic pack get yourself a an enviro cloth and a window cloth then you can see how you like them and see if you want to expand your collection and then get yourself the kitchen cloth trio um, with or without one of the kitchen towels which whatever you think um, because you will love having these in your kitchen um, I will post a link to, I have a party running right now, so I will post a link to the party in the description. And if you do make a purchase, I will send you a quarter sized netted dishcloth. Let me actually grab it for you. Hang on just one second. So this is what I use in my kitchen. Um, exclusively as a sponge. I do not have a sponge in my kitchen. I just use this. It's called the netted dishcloth. It's got all these little holes in it. It holds soap super well and also scrubs super well and it won't be smelly and it doesn't soak up bacteria like kitchen sponges do. So I will send you, this is a quarter size. I, I They come in a huge sheet and I cut it in four. I will send you a quarter size one um, if you ever place a Norvex order through me. It's just a little gift. Um, but I love getting rid of helping people get rid of their sponges and then I did grab this is one of the kitchen towels so I literally just leave it on my kitchen counter um, and put my dishes on top of it and they dry really quickly because <laughs> it soaks up so much of the water um, and I just love it okay if you need any help you can comment or you can shoot me an email or whatever um, but anyway I have a party going and I guess that's all real quick here's what I mean by having a kitchen towel this is actually a little bit smaller than the normal size ones, but um, I just leave it next to my sink. And when I dry my dishes, I just pile them on here and then they dry pretty quickly and I can put them all away. Uh, and then when I'm done putting them all away, I just hang the towel back up right here <laughs> so it can dry. And oh, I told you, remember I have a mini size. This comes in the um, microfiber variety pack, which you get a mini sized window cloth, a mini sized enviro cloth and a mini sized body cloth. I think I use the body cloth on my face to take all my makeup off. Um, but anyway, I keep this hanging inside my kitchen cabinet because I can really quickly wipe down stainless or faucets and make them all shiny again. And then remember that I told you every night I, um, take the dirty cloth and I hang it up to dry overnight. This is where I hang it. I just have a 
hook right here behind my fridge, um, a command strip hook. And I just take whatever's wet, like this one, and I hang it here for the night and it dries. And then once they're dry, I bring them into the laundry room and I have a basket here that I just pile all my Norwex cloths in. Like I said, I have a lot. These are all my Norwex. I have a whole bag of them <laughs> over years of collecting. Um, anyway, I pile them in this basket and then when the basket's full, which is about every two weeks, I wash all my, all my Norwex in one load. And I do use Norwex um, laundry detergent to wash them, uh, but you don't have to. You can use any free and clear detergent. So just don't use like Tide or any of the detergents that have a bunch of um, stuff in them that will gum up the microfiber. You wanna use a free and clear detergent. So like Eco's brand from Costco works um, and there's a lot of free and clear detergents out there. Uh, so yeah.